I'm Casey, welcome to my channel. So this is gonna be the first vlog in 2021. I have so much inspiration in my head right now. It's like so little time, so much to do. So that's going on. I'm Casey, by the way. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm so excited to have you. So this vlog is going to be a very special vlog. I'm gonna vlog a whole week because I did this with my first dog, and I'm gonna do it with my new puppy. Brendan and I, Brendan is my husband, we are picking up our eight week old Rottweiler puppy today. We're getting a male Rottweiler. We have a female Rottweiler already. So we already have our pride and joy, Nala. Nala, come here. We're gonna go bye bye soon. Come here, you wanna go to Petco? I want you to come say hello to everyone. Can you one, two, three, jump up here? So here is Nala. <laughs> say hi. She is just my love. So this is our pretty girl that we have, Nala. We got her in May of 2018, and now we're getting her little best bud, little brother, Simba, to complete our Lion King family. We got Simba from the same breeder that we got Nala from. We are so happy with Nala, so we would never go anywhere else to get a Rottweiler. So we're so excited. I'm picking him up when Brendan gets out of work at like 3.34. It's about 11.30 right now. We have to get a couple things for the puppy, including dog food and a collar. So that's what I'm going to go do now. And I also have to run just a couple more er errands. I am currently doing an egg fast. Yesterday I kind of retrialed it and did like a day one. But today I'm actually going to do it like to a T. So I have to pick up some stuff for that. And I'm going to post all of the meals that I'm doing for the egg fast on my TikTok, so that's exciting. So go follow me on TikTok to see some egg fast motivation if you're wanting to do keto. I, I just decided to do an egg fast to kind of jumpstart and kickstart my keto, my, my journey back on the keto diet. So go follow me there for um, the meals that I'm going to be eating. I'm currently fasting. I haven't even had coffee yet. I've had a couple sips of water. I woke up at 10 because I stayed up until about 2 33 o'clock on decorating for christmas which was a lot i didn't surface clean yet which i still have to do and then i went and laid in bed and i was just starting to get super excited about picking simba up today so i couldn't sleep and then nala was super cuddly and lovey last night and i always take full advantage of that when she's like that so i was just cuddling her and then she woke up Brendan, she like climbed up on top of him and was trying to cuddle with him. So we were both awake and then we both couldn't fall back asleep because we were excited about the puppy. So I probably didn't actually fall asleep until about 4.30, 5 o'clock. So I, I really did only get like five hours of sleep, but it's fine. So I'm a little off kilter today as far as sleep goes. And I'm probably not going to get a lot of sleep tonight with the puppy, but it's fine. It's all part of, you know, bringing him into the family. So... Without further ado, we're going to go run some errands. I'm going to go pick up my little sister, and we're going to go get some Roddy supplies. Let's go. Are you ready, Nala? Nala's coming. She can go in, obviously, the pet store. So, we're off to go get the pup. Molly and I did running around today. We got a couple puppy supplies. We got food. We got a few little toys and the collar. And we got Nala a matching one. Some of the cute little toys we have back here. I want to focus. You can't see me in the back. Look at yeah. He's a little Simba. It's a Kong collar. It's really cute. I got Nala a pink one. And then he's got his couple toys that we got him. I got him a little tire for, you know, being oh, really? tribute to Beanie. <laughs> and a leash that matches the collar. And a blankie. Well, the blankie I had. Yeah. So we have a lot of stuff for, from Nala. So he will be all set. But we had to get a couple of things for him. Like his own. His own little things. So his hedgehog will be like his. I just threw away the toy that was like Nala's toy when I brought her home. It was like a little patriotic bear. Do you remember that? No? I just threw it out. Or was it all the head was the missing, so <laughs> I was like, all right, time, time to go. <laughs> so we're going to get him, so the next time you see me, he'll be in my arms. Yeah. 
Didn't he just this get a bath though? So he might be a little damp. Oh, yeah, hold on. Can you turn the lights back on for a minute? How do you turn them on? Oh, he's, oh, he's playing with the blanket. <laughs> Look at this little boy. Mm. Look at this little boy. Say hi, I'm Simba. Hey. You smell hi. like a puppy. Hi. Hi. Guess, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> no. Honey, it's okay. First okay, ride a little buddy. Tough. Oh my god, Molly, look at him. Is the light okay or do you need to no, turn it's him good. off? No, it's good. Oh, for me? No, I'm good. Okay. Hi, honey. I'm good a little face. Oh, look, now your camera's frying. <laughs> See, it's intermittently okay. I don't understand. Jeez. Here, what, we, what, <laughs> what is he doing? Oh, he's trying to get like oh, cozy. Oh. oh. He's like nestling himself in my arms. You know? I can't. You are so precious. All right. Well, vlog, vlog more at home. Yeah, when but you can see him. Meet Simba. This is Simba. Simba Bean. <laughs> no, this is Simba Bubba. He's a Bubba boy. He's a Bubba boy. <laughs> <laughs> Meet Simba, everybody. This is little boy. He's a big boy, actually. We get those poles. Look at those paws. <laughs> We're going home to see Beanie. Mm. All right, buddy. It's time to go in the house. He's like, uh, I'm so comfortable. Here, so com Simba. Oh, he's, Simba. Going, he's going by. Simba. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Pull him out of the way. Come here, bud. Come here. He's wagging his tail. Come we're on. Dude, car. Come on. This isn't. Come on, buddy. We're gonna run free now. Come on. That was the non car ride. This is the first time they're meeting. You going first, Mom? Look what we got for you. We got some presents for Beanie. Bella, Bella look at this doggy. <gasps> we got a present for you, Beanie. What is this? Oh, Beanie, what is it? Oh, oh. Is this oh, your, Beanie! It's your brother! Oh, Beanie, look! <laughs> it's your brother! He's like stuck in my hair. Here. Shake some chocolate milk over that tilly <laughs> tail. Oh, oh, Beanie, look! Yeah! Where's he going? You got a buddy! Is that your brother? Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, bud. Come here, Simba! Let's turn the light on. Oh my gosh. There we go. Come on, Bean! Bella, is that your brother? That's your brother. That's your brother. Oh, he's scared of oh, her. Oh, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Oh, no, he's kissing her and wagging his tail. He's excited, okay? He's not scared. Oh, my gosh. It's your sister. Nala, no, is it your brother? <laughs> What do you got? Oh my god, I'm reveling in this moment forever. Look at how happy Nala is. <laughs> Look at it. He's your brother, Bean. The yeah. moment you've all been case, waiting for. Case. Behind you, towel. Oh. Or did you get paper towels? Oh, yeah. I did. Well, give it. She's, it's on her shoe, probably. It's right stuff. behind it you. It is on my the shoe. The bag's there. The moment you've all been waiting for. You want some cleaner? I don't know why. It's okay, bud. Look at him. He's like a little afraid. Can I go get her food? <laughs> oh, sure. Actually, should we go potty? Yeah, I'm gonna go potty. You gotta go potty, guy? Nala, look at your brother. Nala, look huh? at your puppy. Yeah, good dude. Hi, it's okay. Yeah. You're like, oh my god, that thing's going nuts. And good girl, you. Baby. I know. Good girl. <laughs> Him. Come here, Simba. You see my Mickey Mouse feet? You're gonna bite him. You're gonna bite him. <laughs> he really likes to like. Oh, you're gonna nest. eat my toes. <laughs> here, toy instead of toes. You're gonna give him a little teething ring. Oh! <gasps> here comes Nala. Big Sis. Big Sis. Does she not face with him? Not really. She like whenever she like goes him? up to him, she like wags her little tail. She's like, oh, 
I'd play with him. Hey, things in my way. Toy. No, no, no. I already heard the word no. You haven't even been home an hour. <laughs> He's so cute. Don't take him. He's got big paws. It's gonna be huge, probably. Gonna be huge. Oh, I'm gonna be a huge boy. <laughs> gonna be a big boy. I love how the inside of his ears are brown. I don't know. He yeah, probably won't. My toe. This won't is stay. He looks like a little grizzly bear. He Apparently does. Like a little black grizzly bear. He's just. They gave him a bath today, oh. <laughs> so he's so fluffy from me. Are they sad to see him go? I don't. I mean, they Is had a whole the litter. Oh, they they have more? another litter after his. Oh wow! Yeah. Litter younger. Yep. Here, I can hold him so you can get a good picture. <laughs> good morning, everyone. It is day two of having Simba home. Really, really just the first day because we got him at like 5 p.m. last night. It was so late. By the time we got home, it was 6.30, I think, actually. So here he is today. Can we see the little boy? Can we see the little boy? Yes, we can see him. Simba, you want to go for a ride? We're gonna go pick up a Target order and get the puppuccino for Beanie. And a coffee for Mama. So last night my uh, egg fast went awry. So we had subs waiting for us when we got home. I got like a gluten-free roll, just trying to do something. I don't, I don't know if gluten-free is less carbs, but I thought I'd give it a shot. I think Simba's collar is too heavy for his little neck. I didn't know that a medium would be too big on him, but I think it is. He did really well in the crate last night. He cried for maybe 20 minutes, and then he quieted right down and just fell asleep. And he did so good. He didn't even, like, cry to go outside, but I woke up. So we went to bed early at, like, 9 o'clock. I think our, my eyes were closed, and I was sleeping before 9. So, like, 8.30, 9 o'clock, which is way early for Brendan and I, especially me. Cried for maybe 20 minutes, and then I woke up at 1.40 a.m., I went to the bathroom, he, I, I came out here, he was sleeping, and then I went back to bed, I couldn't fall asleep, so at almost 4 o'clock I thought I heard him make a peep, so I got up, we went outside, he peed, he pooped, and then I put him back in the crate and I went back to bed, he cried for another like half hour, I ended up falling asleep at that point after I knew he had gone to the bathroom, I must have like felt relieved that he was, I don't know, just like the thought of him sleeping in the crate from even like 9 to 6, that's a long time. So I wanted to break that up a little bit. But we did, and he did so good. And then this morning, Brett did, got up with both of them, fed them while I was still sleeping because I woke up and I, like, I just had a weird night's sleep. So that was our first night with Mr. Simba. And now we're going to go get puppuccinos. Just for Nana, no, not for Simba yet. So, let's grab the pup. Alright, pup. Come here. Come here. Oh, I got him. Oh. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go bye-bye. Ready, Beanie? Oh. See if I can do this. Maneuver two dogs and vlog at the same time. It's not happening. Okay, bye. Alright, guys, we're home. My bun is so large. It's ridiculous. Oh, I'm cold. I'm chilled to the bone. All right, I want to have a little photo shoot with Simba. I always forgot to shut my trunk. So I did like a Target pickup, which I've never done before. And tomorrow I have a Wegmans or um, Walmart pickup. Why are you crying? I broke my egg fast with a double shot on ice with sugar-free vanilla, Splenda, and a splash of cream. There's a lot of ice in there, unfortunately. I should say light ice next time. I'm going to show you what I got. I got some puppy training treats. We got these buddy trainer training chews with natural chicken liver. I got another bag of my Eglin's Best Eggs because those are easy and quick when you're doing the egg fast just to buy those. Oh, um, I thought I got, I thought I got a bunch of avocados. There's only one in here. I got some unrefined virgin coconut oil. And I got some of this Sir, Sir Kennington's avocado oil mayonnaise. Hopefully it's good. I'm going to make my lunch and then I'm going to, or my breakfast, my first meal. And then I think I'm going to like start crate training him a little bit. Oh, I also got a big thing of sriracha. 
He likes to chew my laces. A big thing is sriracha. But this is documenting puppies first week, so side note, side note. He's got his little collar on right now, but I think it's way too big for him. Isn't it too big? I don't really like how we're nibbling this on the side of the counter. Your little head is going to get smushed. Let's go play. Let's go play with brother. I want to do a photo shoot. Want to do a photo shoot? With their collars, their matching King, King Kong collars. <laughs> So we are infamously out back right now. Nala loves it back here. And she clearly has beaten it up quite a bit. Uh, we took, Auntie Bean came over and she played with us for a little bit. And then we um, took a nap on the couch. I'm gonna sneeze. No, don't let him do it. I had Simba right on my arm and I woke up and his tongue was sticking out of me. It was so cute. We probably slept for like either an hour to an hour and a half. And then we just woke up. We went out front to go potty. He did great. He peed and he pooped. Is he coming? Come on, buddy. He can probably fit through the cracks in the fence. We got to be careful. Over here. Um, it's so weird that there's no snow right now. And then we came in, I went to get my sneakers on, and Papa came home. Where are you? The ground is definitely frozen, which is great. Because Nala, we don't want her to get all muddy. Hi, babies! Nala loves her tire. <laughs> wow. The ground is frozen. The kids throw it over the fence. Looks like a chair, something to a chair. <gasps> what are you doing? We're gonna have a nice fence like this on that side and this side of it. Hopefully next summer. But here's the little boy. That's where I filmed my uh, puppy tag with Nala. We have to film one up for Simba too this weekend. Nala, Simba no. Come here, buddy. Simba. Simba, look. Simba. 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 Yeah, yours are going to be just as big. If not bigger. <laughs> Ooh, I got to put my gloves on. So hard. Oh. We just finished dinner. The doggies ate too before we went out back. And I'm going to go get Simba a... <laughs> Container for his food and maybe a maze bowl because he uh, eats way too fast. Nala Nut didn't do that, so he'll be okay. He'll flop right back down. All right, I'm going. I'm still on my egg fast. I'm doing good today. I want to get the property. Good morning everyone, I'm going to talk to you as I get my hydro jug filled for the day. I really haven't been that productive. We kind of woke up at 10. I was like asleep on and off this morning. I got like a solid <clears throat> almost five hours of sleep. I went to bed at midnight last night. I stayed up with Simba, just like trying to wind him down, kind of get him like in a sleepy zone so that he would, he would be okay. But of course, I put him in his crate and went to bed. He still cried like he has been. So, I just planned on waking up when I heard him like crying or trying to get up again. Um, but I ended up falling asleep, I think, after he stopped crying. And I woke up at 4.45 to go potty. I had to pee myself. So, I'm like, alright, I'll go let Simba out too. So... <laughs> I come out here, and he has escaped from his crate. And he was laying in the living room on a blanket that Brendan had put on the ground for him to sleep on when he was watching TV last night. So I was like, what the heck are you doing? And he was up and awake, we went out and went potty, and then I went potty, and then I brought him into bed with us, which I'm just, 
I'm really bad at crate training. We didn't crate train Nala. We tried. I failed. I failed. It was all me. Um, I just want to cuddle with my puppies while they're still little, you know? And while they're big. I just want all of us in bed together, just cuddling. So, I figured it's almost 5 o'clock. Lay in bed for an hour with him, and then I'll get up at 6 with Brendan. Well, that didn't end up happening. What ended up happening, what ended up happening was Brendan woke up. We talked for like two hours in bed, played with the dogs, like pet the dogs, cuddled with the dogs. Wide awake. Oh, he's going in his crate right now. On his own cord, which I love. So we're still gonna have to put him in it when like neither of us are home but anyway so he escaped last night i thought he didn't have any accidents but then i found a little pooper scooper pile by my bedroom door or by the other bedroom i just went in there to get dressed so i cleaned that up but then when we officially got up so simba now and i laid in bed until like 10 o'clock so from like 5 to 10 we were in bed cuddling and sleeping i fell back asleep on and off, I had my alarm set and it was going off, so I didn't get like a quality sleep there, but I was trying to. And then we got up, I tried to feed them breakfast. Simba is a little bit aggressive with his food. I feel weird that I haven't like held him on camera yet. Like here is my boy, he's eating my hair. So yes, he's a little bit vocal when he's eating. I like have been trying to pet him and like put my hands in his face because I just don't want him to ever be aggressive with food or <laughs> anything like that. So we've been working on that and then this morning he wasn't growling at me at all. He didn't really eat a lot of his food. I think now that he knows that he's gonna get fed, he's a little more satisfied and a little bit more secure eating. Oh, he's such a wiggle worm right now. So that was good. And he didn't actually finish his breakfast. Neither did Nala. But right now I have a Walmart order to go pick up. So I'm going to go do that. And then we're going to go get a puppuccino for Nala and show the girls at Starbucks and Nala <laughs> or Simba. No, you're not eating my hair. So here he is. He's a puppy boy. Okay. Let's put our collars on and we'll go get puppuccino. Also, last night at Home Goods, I got Simba a um, container for his food, and I also picked up this large, very large, like the size of my head candle called Love Letters. I loved the lid. It was so cute. It like made me want to decorate for Valentine's Day. I just thought it was pretty. And then I have to work, so oh, I have to lay down for a nap in a little bit too. But yeah, still doing the egg fast, still doing that on TikTok, so go follow me over there to see what I'm eating. And that's that. So we're gonna go run errand. Just a quick one. I'm hoping to be back by noon. Let's go. Um, hello, miss. Um, can you have a seat? Nala, can you sit? Nala, can you sit? Nala, sit. Nala. Come here, I want to interview you. Can you sit? What do you think of your brother? Do you love him? Yes. Is he the best? Yes. Hey, you're biting my toes though. That's not cool. I think he likes these blue socks. All right, we're gonna go get Puppuccino. We're gonna go get Puppuccino. We got home before noon, LOL. I'm gonna eat my breakfast. I'm waiting for my uh, favorite girl to be working at Starbucks that loves Nala past two days well the guy yesterday was nice and he was like cute dog but today the girl just looked at them like didn't say anything kind of made me upset and sad but i'm gonna make my first meal of the day pretty hungry i did uh for my walmart pickup order i didn't get very much stuff but i got an egg slicer i had one but it's gone it's missing i got a garlic um press i've been wanting a garlic press for a while I got a bunch of seaweed and two um, of these containers of the spicy dill pickle blue diamond almonds. Those are my fave. I got some Kerrygold butter, some of these carb balance um, wraps, and some bacon for when I'm done with my egg fast. I can have all this, but until then, we wait. Hey! Okay, I gotta go.
Whew, hi guys, I just edited a vlog. Simba and Lala just went outside and potty. Simba did really good. He actually peed and pooped. So I'm very proud. Very proud. So I'm going to go down for a nap now. I wanted to go down at 3. It was almost 4. I was editing that vlog like I said. So it took me a bit longer than I wanted it to. But I have to work tonight so I have to take a nap. And I think now that Simba went potty he should want to lay down. He's actually been such a good boy today. I can't complain at all. He's a good dog. They both are amazing. I love Rottweilers. <laughs> Say hello everyone. It's Monday. Hi everyone. I think we all forget how utterly exhausting having a puppy is until you actually have one again in your life. <laughs> Brendan and I are beat. He hasn't been sleeping very well the past couple of nights over the weekend um, when I was working. He didn't sleep in his crate, so I don't know. We just didn't do good over this weekend with him in sleeping, so. And I felt like I had his potty training under control and then Brendan does his own thing with him. So it's like, we just gotta get on the same page and it's been hard because we've both been, we've had one day off together so far since we've had him and that was yesterday. And last night, man, I couldn't, I let Brendan sleep and I was just up with him. He sleeps in the living room pretty good. Like he'll, he'll like lay on the floor and he'll actually go to sleep. But in bed he like wants to jump onto the floor. He just like doesn't, he's very distracted and wants to play. But he's just the cutest little boy. I love him so much. Aren't you the cutest? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? We just went out back for a couple minutes. I'm so tired, guys. I might rest until Brendan gets home and then when he gets home I could get some stuff done. I still have to like dust, fold laundry, wash the dishes. Like there's so much to be done and I like can't do anything. I'm so tired. I don't know, I went to get a coffee at Starbucks. So I have this, but I'm so tired. And I didn't vlog over the weekend. I did my egg fast. I lost like four pounds with the egg fast and I've lost eight so far this year. Gonna keep going on my keto train. And I got my double shot on ice, no 2%, no classic. One pump of sugar-free vanilla, one stevia and light heavy cream. Trying to get comfy on your bed? Also, Brendan's mom bought them this bed and Brendan just put a blanket over it just to make it a little more cozy. Pretty little boy. You gonna take a nap on your bed? Say my sissy's out back. Also, I haven't been able to take as many photos of him. I feel like I'm having a hard time doing a photo shoot. He's not as into posing as Nala was. It's so funny. But that's the pup date. I'll probably talk to you guys later. I actually feel like closing my eyes again. And it's like 36 degrees and sunny. So Nala is absolutely fine out back. So I might just close my eyes for like a half hour. And then go let her in. And then drink my coffee. I'm like beyond exhausted. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's uh, Tuesday. It's the sixth day that we've had Simba home. It's about 1.30 in the afternoon. Uh, yesterday was a pretty good day. Simba did really good yesterday. And actually he slept really well last night. But I did not sleep well. But it wasn't because of him. It was just because I couldn't fall back to sleep after I let him out. 1.15 in the morning. So it wasn't his fault. I... I mean, he had to go potty. It wasn't like a big deal. So after I got him back to sleep, I couldn't fall asleep. It didn't actually take long for him to calm down, and then I couldn't fall back asleep. It was just like, that is what it is. 
So I stayed up from like two to six and then I got up out of bed. I ate breakfast and then I lay down on the couch. And then Brendan probably left around seven and I pretty much knocked out after that on and off until about 10 o'clock and then I called my sister to come over to watch them or watch the puppy while I took a nap because I have to work at three o'clock. So I'm making some chicken right now. That's why that's sizzling. But he's just laying in here, cute as a button, just laying there, cuddled up. For some reason, our heat is like not kicking on. It's freezing in here. But there's a the little boy. He just looks like a little fur ball down there, huh? Hi, buddy. Hi, Meester. Oh, this morning also him and Nala were running back and forth playing with each other. It was the cutest thing I've ever seen. Why is this not focusing? This is way out of focus. There we go. And then um, we were keeping like tons of toys out to occupy him whenever he might get bored. Because he's been trying to eat the couch. Which we don't want. And where is he going? Oh, to hide from me. Are you cold, mister? He just is curled up in a ball back there. The thing about him and Nala is they, if they're sleeping, they don't want to be bothered. They like want to be by themselves. So, and him and Nala got along really well while they were playing. It was the cutest thing ever. Now we're just chilling, waiting for me to get called into work. And I'm really cold. And I think little, little man is too. And Auntie Bean is still here. And that's Tuesday. Tomorrow it'll be a week. And I'll talk to you guys then probably because I have to know what like I said. Meester is nine weeks old today. Give me kisses. No kisses. Oh, this my baby. This my baby. Get it. Oh my god. See your little fight. <gasps> Here he is. Hi everyone. So it is now Thursday, January 14th. Simba's been home with us a whole week as of yesterday. And I didn't vlog yesterday because... I was tired. I had to work last night. I got home. I just got home. It's about 8 o'clock. Timba's doing great. We are very proud of this little fluff ball. Simba, come here. Simba, come here. Oh, you, you're all slobbery from your sis. You're all slobbery from your sis. Drinking all the water, Nala. They're getting along pretty well. They were just both drinking water at the same time. Come here. Let's sit down and say hello to Simba. <laughs> I spoke too soon. Can you sit? You were just playing out back pretty hard, huh, Beanie? So, what I like to do when I get home from work is kind of tire them out. Brendan maybe left like 20 minutes before I get home. And um, he puts the little guy in his crate. <sighs> Simba! Simba! Here he is. Look at that cute boy. Look at that cute boy! Say hi, I'm Simba. Say hi, I'm Simba. Hi. <laughs> Say hi, I'm Simba. This is some cute puppy footage. This is some cute puppy footage. He's very curious about the camera. He's very curious about the camera. Huh, Beanie? So he's very fluffy in comparison to Nala, who's very silky smooth. <laughs> Huh, Nala. So Nala's a Siberian or Serbian Rottweiler and he is a German Rottweiler. So I'm interested to see how different their fur is. Also, I think his tilly tail is going to be a lot shorter than Nala's nubby nub. Not. No, thank you. I don't want you to bite my clothes. Sharing is caring. Sharing is caring. Nala will just drag him across the floor. Watch. And then she starts whipping and it gets me all nervous. 
But overall, we are exhausted, but it's gonna be so worth it when I see those two little brown tushies walking away from me for years and years and years. Best buds of all time, you and Simba will be. Hi, huh, Simba. Hi, huh, Simba. Let's, here, come here. Let's say a little outro for the people. Beanie. Beanie. Now it's here too. Look it. Let's say a little outro for the people. So, with that being said, our little Nug is uh, nine weeks old now. And we'll be vlogging all this weekend because it's my birthday weekend. Won't we? He's already like sweeter than Nala and the fact that he's not as, he doesn't have as big of an attitude as Nala does. Nala has a big attitude. Oh, uh, yeah. I, I noticed that with him like he lets us pick him up and snuggle him and she really did not like that when she was a puppy She <laughs> didn't want to be held ever But he likes it. He likes to be cuddled and kissed. Ooh, my battery's gonna die All right, so that's gonna do it for this vlog our first week with our second Rottweiler puppy I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it probably wasn't that informative I'm not like a puppy training expert by any means. I break all the rules. I definitely don't know everything when it comes to puppy training even though I've had several dogs growing up I just kind of do it my way and what feels right for me um, socializing them bringing them around dogs and all humans that's like the most important thing for me is them to be friendly and okay with all animals and all people that's like my number one priority so socializing is it for me crate training <clears throat> the only reason I'm not a fan of is my heart can't handle putting them in the crate so we don't even have a crate for Nala and Simba probably won't be in his for too much longer <laughs> but anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video I, I do hope it was informative in some way if you're thinking about getting a Rottweiler definitely do your research they have a temperament that is unlike any other breed I can answer any questions you have about the breed down below. I'm pretty well aware of how Rottweilers are and how they act and how, what you need to do to nip things in the bud and also to not be afraid of certain features of a Rottweiler. There's this thing that they do that's called the Roddy Purr, which Nala is an expert at and it means, you know, sometimes when they're happy they sound like they're growling at you but really they're just love and extra hard on you because that's the sound they make when they're happy and it's confusing to people and frightening to others and it's a thing and uh it's cute and unique and i love it personally so yeah <laughs> that's it for simba you'll be seeing him grow up on this channel as you did nala and i hope you guys stick around for more roddy vlogs and other content for me in 2021 approaching my 30th birthday here we go got a new puppy here we got a lot going on so i hope you guys stay subscribed say subscribe to our channel okay bye okay bye okay bye <laughs> Hello? Hi, Kim, what are you doing? I need some puppies. Oh, just watching my